here now with me? What? Oh, nothing. Nothing. Well, the controller's vibrating. That's weird. It's vibrating to the beep. That was weird. It was. Didn't know they put haptic feedback support in this game for that one fucking moment. the planet it pulled the moon out of the sky we don't know what that technology can do so that's it we were saved by fucking aliens i quit trying to make sense of it all back on the ishimura come on this this can't be real what are we supposed to do now well for starters get the hell out of here and go where back to earth yeah if we're dead we can do what we want, right? Right. Hmm. Guess I'm gonna go jerk off in the corner then. I don't know how it goes. I'm always interested in friends' adventures. Hmm. So, do we have the same guns? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I guess. Yay, one of these. Oh, oh god gosh. damn it. Wee. Are you ready for it? Are you ready for it? Climbing walls, yeah. The lag might. You, uh, doing it? Yeah. Yep. I was. There, there we go. go. I was holding it for so long, I guess it just, like, glitched. So, ah, I forgot how to jump. Where are we? Don't know. Buried underground, I guess. Keep climbing. I won't? Yeah. yeah. What the? I made that shit. I don't understand, can you only jump every so often? Cause... There we go. It's a little fucky. I'm not sure why... I can't jump, jump over. <laughs> I'm not sure why falling... Hold the jump button when you do it. It feels like that makes a difference. Those segments are pretty non-responsive. Yeah. There's too many of so them, for sure. Them. There it is. Why is it way over there? That's kind of why I think people didn't really like this game, too. There's a lot of, like, repetitive weird shit like that. Down by the machine. I still don't understand how we survived. You don't need to. They switched our suits to the suits we're supposed to be wearing. <laughs> well, I'd know if I was dead, man. Man, I don't even know what dead means anymore. Are we Necromorphs? Is this what they feel like after the after the marker reanimates them? He you said Necromorphs. Holy shit! Could you be any more crazy? Hell no! We are not Necromorphs. We killed the thing that makes them. At least we don't have to put up with that shit anymore. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. No more moon. No more marker signal. 
No more necromorphs, at least that's on our side. Yeah. They keep saying necromorphs like it's it, 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 Like is that their legitimate name? Yeah. One of their ships has to be around. But I never heard it in the game well, until now. Let's get looking, big boy. That's not funny. Uh no, I think they said it at the beginning of the game too. Ellie and them did. Oh. People in the other games have referred to them as Necromorphs, too. I don't remember. Through this door. You know, what did you think it was just something people... Oh! Whoa! You think it was just something people called them? I, I didn't know. Like, I, us, like, because we played the game, but. Don't freak out. We should use this bench and suit kiosks to load up. Just in case. Tripping balls. Wait, what? What? I own the security suit for Dead Space 2. Dead Space 2 suit. Oh, yeah. Might as well finish it up in classic style. Oh yeah, baby. Feels good to be the king. Hell yeah. Finish this shit out. Original. Un L Badger. Oh. Those are blueprints. Okay. All right, I see what you're doing. It's not canonical, we stomped you. Wow, you ain't seen those fat guys this whole game. Oh my god, I forgot I put a rocket launcher on that. I still thought I had my cryo flamethrower. Just shot you in the back of the head point blank with a rocket in my face. Ah! I was starting it. Fuck it. Where the fuck did it come from? 
Either we're actually crazy, or we didn't stop the markers. Oh, God. Ellie. No! Isaac! We have to get back! We've got to warn Earth! We need a ship, fast. Come on! Oh, you don't want to do it? Oh, I, you're the engineer wearing the engineer suit. I'm wearing the security suit. Ah, damn. It was right there. What, really? Are these in the or same order every time? Are they talking? I hear some chanting. They're hungry, they're coming. I don't remember this. They are language. Yo! I'm going on a magic trip with my favorite rocket ship. I'm in a special place. Oh my god, what the fuck is going on? I'm being hunted by shadow children in the shadow realm. Oh god, you uh should hurry. Alright, I'm moving as fast oh, I'm back. I'm back. What happened? The moon network. They're awake. What? This moon must have contacted the others before we could kill it. Then we really have to get to Earth and warn everyone. But I don't think they know where Earth is yet. Good! Then let's hurry the fuck up and find a ship! No, maybe we shouldn't go to Earth. Think about that. That's the correct thing to do. Not lead them there. I mean, Man. I would like to use the toilet again. Oh, shit. We'd all like to use the toilet again, Carver. Sadly, that's just not in the cards for men like us. We don't get to shit in toilets. Imagine a Left 4 Dead style Dead Space 4 player. That'd be pretty badass. Like maybe there was a group of people that survived the initial outbreak on the Ishimura and all four of them fought their way to the Ishimura and escaped. Kind of like the Wii version, but not a shoot em up like it was. Yeah. Oh god, I'm sorry. Anytime I see children, I just go into my immediate response. Wait, these are the kids? Yeah. They're screaming. Well, these are alien kids. Alright, that's better. I pulled out the assault rifle. I don't remember there being so many of these little fuckers. This is what I was fighting in the shadow realm, though.
better to load up because if I remember from here on out, it's just like waves of enemies. Like, like I said, all hell's broke loose. Earth is pretty much already lost. Kill yourself. I mean, not alive yourself. And I will lead the way. We really just left a guy there. I did. Like this, like this, this is the end of the world. There's just a dude there. Oh no! I accidentally like... Nice. Yeeted away one of my health packs. Oh no. Got so much health. Wait. Like almost no goddamn ammo. What am I seeing? That's oh. Ellie, I think. They're taking off. Damn it! There's not gonna be any left if we don't hurry. What does it mean they? Like Ellie's the only person alive. Aside from that guy we passed Panic. down there. Danix men are escaping. That's what that broadcast was, uh, an emergency broadcast between Danix men to abandon the crusade and leave. Oh yeah, right, we're hey. struggling to get a ship. Another dude left here. Might be good, sir. He'll be alright. He'll bounce back. I heard he's got family around here. Everyone's dead. <sighs> Ooh. Oh my oh, god, shit. they're jacked up raptors. Oh, now it's the alien raptors. They're so jacked. Line gun works really well for those guys. Just takes their fucking legs right out. There was one behind us? I think so. There's something here. Is that just a light? Am I crazy? Got it. I knew it. Find you. Oh, thank God I was reloading. Let's get the fuck out of here! Ah! Oh my God, I punched him.
God damn it. Kill a bunch of people to save a bunch of people. Crap, there goes another one. We're gonna get stranded down here. It was closer. Might be more nearby. <coughs> Almost. Oh, uh, damn, this is a wrong time for a shroom trip. Can anyone hear me? It's never a wrong My time for a shroom trip. The and the it's a wrong time for other people for you to have a shroom trip. Their minds. I can see other ships taking off. I want to respond. If anyone can hear me, we're on the roof of the vehicle. Ah, oh, oh, Jesus! Was that Paul? There, I fixed it. Whoa. What? Hey, how come you didn't kill yourself? Hey, how come you didn't kill yourself? You should, you should unalive yourself, sir. They are See you later, buddy. That guy is so weird. Wait, I gotta drop off these chips. I did give him a Snickers bar. You think it'd be alright? Mm -hmm. I can remember somebody telling me he was allergic to peanuts. Uh, I don't want to take it back, back now. The vehicle depot is right outside. That ship could still be here. Better be. Seems like so much effort to take it back now. Mm -hmm. He's cool. He knows his limits. There's the ship. Hell yeah. What, what the fuck? That's not what I thought I was doing, but sure. Crazy. Oh, we have to both push the button. It's down here. Ah! Alright, it was just just our imagination, that's fine. Well, you better calm down. I'm tripping so great. Oh I just know what no one
Dude, why do these necromorphs look so fucked up? Because they're aliens. These are now all the alien versions of like the other things. These are like... I guess it's kind of like there's like a different strain of whatever the fuck it is. The more alien version of it. It's so weird. It, it's reminding me of Resident Evil 7. They look like the mold men. Like some of them are evil. Or no, not evil, but... Some of them, I think, are mo are mostly human, but they've been mutated differently because it's like a different version of the, of the same thing. But it was like more in line for like the aliens on this planet. Because the only thing to infect you here is whatever the alien version of it that they got. The other version is like a version that like was specific to humans because it was on their planet and shit. You know what I mean? It's only got impulse. So but I don't know, I'm not really clear because it doesn't really tell you if it's actually a virus that's doing this to people or if it's just the, like, <clears throat> magic of this fucking marker? I don't know. Like, the actual thing that turns somebody in dead space is... Infector. Yeah, but no, because people can turn without the infector. I mean, yeah, for the most part, yes. But, like, there are moments when people turn without it around, so there is some sort of, like, other influence. Is that the Ishimura? No. No, it was the, uh... Terranova. Terranova. Yeah, the Terranova. It's coming from the cradle. What happened to the other ships? One of them lied to you, I guess. Come on, let's take a look. Yeah, let's hey, go there's, back. There's ship. Must have been hit by a mine. Looks like someone removed the shock when I tried to. <laughs> of course. They must have taken it inside. Come on. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? That's so stupid. Like, that makes no sense. God damn it, I got oxygen for days. You good? You having a little bit of a problem back there? <laughs> See, you uh, like I'm trying to smear your face on the fucking railing. Okay, there we go. I'm good. Good now. Sounds like a delightful you gentleman. Let's see if we can break this lockdown. I was a little around to that. Yeah. Woo. Woo. Gives me Dead Space 2 vibes. Where do these motherfuckers get all these candles? Every Dead Space game, these motherfuckers got like a candle manufacturer on their side or something. There's just so many candles. They're like, guys, ready to go take over the universe? Paul, remember to get all 3,552 candles we need?
Uh, for those people? Yep. Yep, it's all cultists from here on out. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure after this point, like after we left the planet, it's, it's going to be like cultists. So we're killing humans. All right, I'm down for that. Four, three is now. We kind of always been killing humans. Now what? Let's head back to the elevator. We're killing strangers. Strangers in the night. Oh. Oh, we just came here to do that. Interesting. Gotta pay the troll toll. Gotta love the dance space franchise. Ah! Isaac. Oh. Like, even though this game really jumped a sharp, it's still like aesthetically is very awesome to look at. Voices in my head. They want me to to lead them. Did you hear it? What? No! No! I didn't what? hear it! No, what? No! No! I didn't hear it. <laughs> it was like Mark Wahlberg. You here to kill us? Do. What? No! When people hear voices in their heads, it means that they're going crazy. You are going crazy, alright? Now let's get the fucking shock point dry. So wait, did you actually hear anything on your side? Yes. What'd you yeah. hear? There was an old voice talking to me, telling me that I should take them. Like a, a deep, like almost womanly voice, kind of. That twisted ass fucking religion. You said you wanted to be Muslim. <laughs> you want to be edgy, be a unitologist. Um. Whoa, okay. Yeah, get used to it. This is what every fight's like, too, because we're all fucking nuts. They teleport around. I got you. <laughs> I just seen him swarm when I was like, rocket. It had to be, right? Ah, fuck it. We're getting out of here. Where's the conning tower? The mid station. We'll need to take the tram. It's funny how. Just see it on, like, uh. CTV scanner, and it's just us tripping out, just shooting at nothing. Yeah, I think that's pretty much what is happening. Like, all this should happen long before we were here, but the marker's, like, showing it to us. Or the, not the marker, but the moons, I guess. Mid station? Uh, yeah. Let me look at the... From cunning, we gotta get the cunning tower. Is your soul prepared to feed them, or will you be judged unworthy and cast aside? Join me as we build a new church together, not of brick and mortar, but of flesh and blood. A church. Join me in a tribute so glorious that the heavens themselves will take notice. They are coming, my brothers, and we will be ready. Yeah. This motherfucker keeps talking to me too. Better not be. We have become too many, too little to go around. Corporations that we once trusted with our money have squandered. We once trusted with our future. I see you approaching. Don't be afraid. All are welcome to be a part of our church. But what I want a church. You give? An ear that you may hear that message. A tongue that you may speak. Ah! Tripping balls, man. 
That freaks me the fuck out. I got grabbed me in my mind. Grabbed my mind hole. Dude, I'm actually freaking out right now. Holy shit. Yeah, this part gets pretty fucking weird. I think if he grabs you, I think you die. Oh, no. Is he actually hurt? Is he hurting me? I don't remember this. I remember fighting him, but I don't remember. Sure, firing bullets like it was pretty fucking real. Just firing bullets around. It's not real. Calm down. I love how he's trying to reassure him. Well, he's also fucking everyone over. Because yeah. Isaac clearly is hearing things. Yeah, but Carver's like making it seem like, oh, I'm not hearing anything. You're the only one hearing things. You're mm -hmm. crazy. I'm fine. Even though this already happened to you earlier. There's literally a whole mission where you go do this. Where fucking Carver like trips out and goes into his own little world. Yeah. I never understood this guy. I don't know why this guy is so special to the marker or whatever. Like, I guess it was somebody who can manipulate just to go straight for Isaac because it hates him. Because these people, most of them haven't turned. A lot of these people. They're just fucking crazy contests. How many people are on the ship? Or are we just tripping? Or, and there's nobody. Well, it's kind of weird that there are people on this ship. Because when we came here initially the first time, there was no one on this ship. So people that like, came to this ship do their own like weird fucking cult shit. We're just like we gotta go here. Mm, which way are we going? Oh here. We will live forever. You got some shit? Have some shit? Want some shit. Kyle's gonna get you with the Kodak disc. Kodak disc. Gun part and it was like, you gotta lose your damn mind, bro. Fuck, and I have to do this fight with this guy chasing me? Oh. <laughs> what happened? I got swarmed. Did that happen because I grabbed this? Nope, I didn't even get it that time.
Damn. Let's try this again. God damn, dude. <clears throat> huh, what are you being attacked by? People. <laughs> Obviously, man. What kind of people? They're just the cultists. Claws. Yeah, cultists. At first it's three, then it goes to four, then it goes to five. Shit. Damn, I killed myself. <clears throat> yeah, I'm not entirely sure what it wants you to do at this point. Trying to figure out which one of us is supposed to end it. I, what I'm doing, I have like a bunch of those like runny dudes coming after me, they're like little scrawny guys. And then I have that fucking like cultist leader dude hunting me the whole time and he's like invincible. to the reactor, all right? And then we're gonna throw it in and destroy the ship. No one goes to Earth, Carver. No one. Uh, yeah, we'll see about that. Yeah, this is where they start at being at odds. Isaac knows they can't go back, and Carver's like, I want to go home. Hmm. Did you not see that guy? No. 
for that. One way or another, I'm installing that shock point drive. I'm, I'm not gonna that. let you kill Ellie. You were just fine letting her die as Danik's hostage. You knew what was at stake. It's your fault the moons woke up in the first place. Yeah? Fuck you. Yeah, I never really thought about it like that. Carver is kind of a piece of shit. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah blame man. me. Just because I woke up the ancient planet alien that wants to eat Earth. Who hasn't done that? It's, it's fake, fake news. news. Anybody, Anybody could have done it. I didn't do it. What are you talking about? What the fuck? My brain! Oh, oh shit! Oh, it's getting worse! Just stay out of my way. I don't just want to shoot dear you. Dear God, you just stay this. out of our I'll way. Drop you. I was already aiming <laughs> There's a workbench in here, drop some parts on. Also a new part. Up here. Which I'm gonna have to now drop these pieces off and go grab another part because actually I don't. I had enough. MK2 Kinesis support. Some of these chips on my car. Oh my god. Fucking gun on the beast now. Fear not. This one will be. There is speech. As promised, by the prophet Michael Auckland, the black mark has a plan for all of you. Terrible. will lift us up from our miserable <laughs> I missed the Ishimura. Where were we when we first started? Aft station or four station? First station, I want to say. So we're going aft. Has gone. The Church of Unitology is waiting for you, my friends. Throw off the chains. Of Throw off the chains. And join us as the new one begins. I won't. I'm Jacob Arthur Danik, and I am this message. <laughs> Brothers and sisters, the age of man is at an end. We have become too many, too little to go around. Corporations that we once trusted with our money have squandered it. The governments that we once trusted with our future. Separate. All right. 
Sounds very happy. Now arriving. Engineering and repair. I think he's in a good place. But there's no way he's coming from this door. Oh. We're not allowed to go in that door. But it sounds uh. like it would have been a fun party in there. Wish that would have been nice for us. Do you have a tungsten bar? I think I do. I should, I should have one more, I think. Yep. Got yep. one? Yep. I was gonna make one. Was there a workbench nearby? Yeah, over here. Either over here or... There's a workbench. There we go. Sell some of these fucking parts. These fucking Kinesis modules. Kinesis in them. Yeah, I still have two tons to mirrors. I'm so, so confused. What's going on? <laughs> I blew myself up. Oh, wrong way. You have to go that way.
reactor should be right up here. Now, when we get there, you're wrong, Carver. Going home is just what they want us to do. Oh, would you stop and listen to yourself, man? You're a fucking lunatic. You're not setting foot in this engine room. Only one of us is getting out of this room alive. It is gonna be your funeral, man. We're supposed to try to kill each other. But do we really need to, Zach? Do we really need to dance this one? Catch me, gay thoughts. me <laughs> are we are we actually shooting at each other no well i don't know i mean in the context of the game yeah like in the universe probably but like as far as like us actually like shooting at each other in the game like, for real no it's uh we're like fighting weird after images of each other but i mean we are both in the same room and bullets are flying so Pretty easy for a motherfucker to have an accident, you know? Most definitely. Yeah. You know you can make health packs and shit at Oh, I'm. That was a one shot. The reactor should happen. be right up here. Now, when we get there, no idea. Just shot my head off. Going home is just what they want us to do. Oh, would you stop and simply? listen to yourself, man? You're a fucking lunatic. No. You're not setting foot yeah. in this engine room. Only one of us is getting out of this room alive. <laughs> it is yeah, gonna be your funeral, man. Scat's goat. Oh 
Oh my god. We back. Oh no, I'm not back. I went to further. Oh, we're both here. Even now, we can feel it. Further, this is where I've been going. Teeming with markers. From each world we devour, a new brother will rise and be made whole. Our network will grow, and we will. Well, I'm gonna put one of these guys down. Oh my God, it's actually letting me. I put down a robot. Robots are on the drug trip too. The marker. Let's go. Yeah. Oh shit! Shoot it. Ah! He's hurt. Not for long. Shoot it. Wait, did it take you away from me? Oh, no, you're fine. Trigger, trigger warning, seizure warning. Stop. Yeah, little baby, we're going home. You got your way. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot so you. So where do we put the shock point drive? The unitologist must have set up an adapter. Let's split up and look around. <laughs> okay. Let's see what happens when we fire it up. Zero G. Let me guess. Zero G? Nope. Two person button. God damn it. Maintenance mode enabled. Opening containment shield. Oh, yeah, I remember this. Warning. Reactor is active. Arm ah! activity detected. Please maintain a safe distance from the core. We need to double the power output. How? If we can find some fuel orbs, we should be able to throw them directly into the core and force a power surge. Is that gonna work? Yeah, if the ship doesn't blow up first. Uh, one of these is blue, I think, or something? No? Uh... Oh no. Oh 
Oh. Found one. Were you able to move that? Yeah. yeah. Oh, we're supposed to grab them out of the center of these. Is that what's going on? Reactor overload. Venting initiated. Shit! The heat sinks are venting the core. What do we do? Shoot them! We need to force the reactor to overload. Yeah, this is where it gets a little dicey. Because... Let's start shooting out three, I think. That may that laser's just Venting complete. Reactor output nominal. God damn it. I'm out of ammo for this gun. You're gonna have to shoot Same it. Thing I'm playing. Alright. What do I shoot? The little yellow things that pop up on the side. No, they'll pop up down there. Overload. See those things that just popped out? Oh. Yeah, I'm out of ammo. Warning. Reactor capacity critical. Ah. Got another one coming. Oh, shit. Thing go. What? Do you see that weird orb? Yeah, yeah I, I got, got it. it. Oh, there. I don't remember where these things come out at. Here, I'll freeze it. and initiate the shock before this thing tears itself apart. Let's find a way out of here. Reactor overload. Reactor overload. Deadly radiation levels detected. All hands abandon ship. All hands abandon ship. Reactor overload. Reactor overload. Deadly radiation levels detected. It's like, what do you plan to do to Earth when you get there, anyway? Do what? So it's like, what do, you, what do you plan to do when you get back to Earth, anyway? Like, how are you uh, going to stop this? What is this thing? 
go back to my condo. You don't know this, but I have a condo. Oh yeah. <laughs> it's gonna overtake us! No shit! Fly faster! Okay, what happens when we hit the front of the ship? Look for a ventilation hole. We'll have to bust through. Is that even possible? Would you trust me? Convenient. I broke my arm. How did that not create a vacuum to the outside? Head to the cockpit. We gotta launch before like, it blows. Yeah, why was there I'm even going. a vent anyway? There's nothing to vent in this space. Like that would already create an air vacuum inside the ship. I don't know. Danger. Danger, Will Robinson. Let's go, let's go. We may just blow up. We may just get saved by aliens again. Just get the damn what? Space looks so weird. <laughs> I'm sorry, warp speed. Carver. Psst. Hey, Carver. We're almost there. Are we ready? Yeah. Please. D shopping to Earth space in three, two, one. Earth Orbital Control, this is Isaac Clark aboard the CMS Terra Nova requesting clearance, over. Oh, are you sure you got the right channel? This is over 200 years old. Yeah, no, yeah. change it over, right? Trust me. Trust me, it's right. EarthGov Command, this is Sergeant John Carver. Do you read me? Is anyone there? It's weird. United Mining Traffic dun, dun, dun. Flow, <laughs> Lunar Flight Control, this is CMS Terra Nova. Does anyone read us out here? Well, what the fuck? That's pretty rough. That, that was. <clears throat> yeah, that's how Dead Space Three ends. Well, is that? Yeah. What do you think? That I was, was just. It. Yeah, that was. I just <laughs> I thought there'd be a little bit more or something. Every bit there. what I told you. Exactly. Yeah, yeah no, right, right, right down, down to the T. Yeah, that's uh, not good. They're like, did Isaac and Carver ending. die? Was the moons really there? I don't know. Yeah, and like outside the spaceship, it's like way better graphic than inside. <clears throat> I mean, it's cool, I guess. I, it doesn't really bother me when like characters lose. You can't skip it, remember? No. Yeah, like, uh, it doesn't really bother me when characters die. <clears throat> the main characters or whatever, if it's. 
decent, but that just left so many open things. Like, did all of humanity die? And it was just over? Well, they had, like, like different, different stations, stations around... I don't know. That's just... Because I don't think Earth was the only colony planet, right? No, the aliens were. They found... There was a bunch of them. They do it all the time. That was the thing. Is like, the aliens found a marker and they managed to stop it. Because the cycle of what was happening to their planet was almost over. <clears throat> and then they were gonna fucking... When we found the marker, it's the same kind of process that started with our planet. I thought markers were, like, a good thing. I don't know, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> There's so much weird shit about Dead Space, like, nothing's really good. Like, the markers were created to spread them, and in the first game, for some reason, the marker stops. I guess it's just the marker was put there to hold something back until you found it. Or it was put there to keep something away. And because, like, the way the marker works, like, the marker wanted to go back to where it was in the first game. So, like, the marker is also not good. Like, it's good in the sense that it keeps them in bay, but it, it's a, it was like a machine or, like, an AI-type deal thing that was basically, like, programmed with the instinct that, like, I will kill everything around me and do absolutely everything necessary to get back to where I'm supposed to be. And then there's, like, the Necromorph Outbreak, which was, like, being held back by the Marker. So the Marker was, like, kind of a good thing, but it was also, like, tearing everybody apart mentally and shit, because it's like, I have to get back to this place. I think. That's what I get from it, anyway. It was like, they're both two separate entities. The Marker is merely just, like, a, a lock to hold it in place. But once that lock is removed, it has, like, its own, its own, uh, mental state, I guess? Like, it has its own, its own AI or, like, its own consciousness that it's, like, I have to drive, I have to get back to that spot to do my job. And I'll manipulate and kill people to do whatever I have to do to get back there. You know hmm. what I'm saying? So, like, they're both two different things. They're kind of connected, but they're both, like, two separate sides, and they're both, like, <laughs> not good for your health. I think, anyway. I don't know. It's not It's not very clear. I don't remember there being anything after the credits, either. That was pretty much it. It might be a little something. Did you enjoy it? Yeah, yeah I, I did. did. So, so, this is what it says. Uh, markers, markers are an enigmatic double helix shaped obelisk with, of extraterrestrial origin. They possess their own language. The uh, purpose of these objects is to reproduce through intelligent civilizations and create necromorphs until a converges convergence event is triggered only forming a feather moon but that doesn't make any sense though uh, why would the marker type trap of... the marker was what was holding it in place on Tau Volantis and when they took the marker that's when the shit woke up so like, the marker has to be there to stop the necromorph this is what it says here that there's two types of markers uh, known to exist. Black markers yeah, there's the and red black markers. and the red ones. The black ones are the real markers. The, reds were, the red ones were fake ones made by humans. Or replicas, anyway. To the best they could. You don't interact with a black marker at all in the game. You only interact with the red ones. <clears throat> so I'm not sure. That's what I'm saying. I don't know what the entire, like... Humans made those, like, that's what they say, like, the Tau Volantis or whatever they're like, or even the one on, like, the one on Earth, they were like, humans made that. They, we put that there hundreds of years ago. But it's not the real one. The black marker we found, was the, the one on Earth, was a real marker. But for some reason, humans put a marker there. And it's 
the red ones are distinctly different than the, the black ones for some reason. I don't understand it. But that was the only thing I was always interested too is you never come in contact with a black marker in this game. It's always just the red ones. Like you never go to see the main marker that you found on Earth. Doesn't make any sense though. I, I know none of it makes any sense. That's what I'm saying. Like it's all it all like kind of contradicts itself. It's very weird. That was a very sh DLC mission too. I know. I, to I told you. It wasn't even an. Was it an hour? Uh, yes, yeah, probably about an hour and a half. I mean, it probably would have been a little bit shorter, but we stopped at like workbenches and stuff, so it's probably about an hour. I told, you it's only, I told you it's only like an hour to maybe two hours long. Oh. That was good, though. Yeah, I like this game. I don't think it's a good Dead Space game, but I think it's a pretty good game. And then I just think that if they. I think that if the. At least the ending would have been better. Because when I remember when I was playing this game and I was like, oh, like I was kind of loving the game. Like, I didn't really care too much for the weapon stuff, but I was kind of loving it. And then by the end of it, like, people were like. When I saw the ending, I was like, dude, that com completely ruins it for me. You basically just told me that Dead Space is over. Like, this was the last game. I mean, and that's the thing. Like, okay, so... Isaac killed one moon. It's quite possible he could kill another, but... I don't think he could kill three. Yeah, I mean, there wasn't even three in some of the visions I was having. There was, like, ten moons. Like, the three were just the ones you could see because that's all that could fit on screen. No, no there were six, six back there. there. Like, like, I was looking at it, I was like... like and that, that was, was just weird how they did the placing of it. Of it. Like, like, it was, like, like six. They were, like, like doubled up together. I don't know. Well, the thing that killed me is, like, they were, like... Like, the, the, the way they did it, like, you couldn't see the other moons, but I'm like... How many moons can you hide way out in the open <laughs> space? Like you can maybe hide a few behind, like, Earth before it rose up. But, like, the one comes up, like, right in front of you. And it's like, dude, you didn't see that from, like, way back there? Yeah, like, like is he just, like, moon, slowly right? rising up? Like, like yeah. Rah. Yeah. But, I mean, the moons seem to move really fast, too, though. Like, they were, like... Yeah, yeah they, they were, were hauling ass. ass. Mm, it's very strange. It's kind of cool. I mean, I liked I liked the lore of like the moon and stuff, but they never go any deeper into it. I thought it would have been even cooler if there was like if they delve deeper into like the lore of like uh like everything exists, but like everything is also its own its own thing in nature. Like like maybe the maybe the sun was some sort of weird creature too or some shit. Whereas, like, <clears throat> it kind of made us look like bacteria in this, like, grand cosm, and it's like, oh, humans only feed this, like, but we're now, like, fighting back, you know what I mean? Like, they could have gone into, like, way more. Like, like we're microorganisms. Yeah. I think that would have been kind of cool. Just to show, I mean, not that we are microorganisms, in it, but just, like, to show your size in the universe. In comparison to, like, a bug or some shit, you're just like, whoa. It would have been cooler. That they would have kept going, but they were just like, yeah, the moons are alive. Like, maybe there could have been, like, even giant creatures, like, out in space or some shit where the moons, like, come from. Like, maybe the moons are just baby versions of it, and it eventually turns into, like, a much more, like, giant Cthulhu-ass looking creature. Yeah. Like I said, it was just kind of like, once you hit the moon like that, it was like, how much bigger can you really go in a horror game? Because, like, Isaac killing the moon was already fucking insanely stupid. So it's like, how, how much do you go from there? Like, what really could he do against something any bigger than that? They even explained it away in the game, because they're like, he has to have a special device to kill it. Where you got the, like, yeah, supercharged yeah. kinesis and shit, and the fucking cannon from the, the, the weapon. To pick, to pick up, up markers, markers and launch, launch them back, back out. Mm -hmm. I mean, overall, it wasn't a bad game. It was just very obscure. If they wouldn't have done the moon thing and they wouldn't have done like the ending the way they did it, I think it would have been fine. 
It wouldn't have been my favorite one. It's, it's still pretty decent. It's kind of it's fun to play with second person and shit, but that ending, man, it's terrible. Like, and they basically just said, "All right, Dead Space is over. We're not making it anymore." And they have it till the remake. And technically, that's not even a new game. It's just a remake of this one. Or of the first one, I mean. <clears throat> Which is probably all we're gonna get. Like, are we, are we may never ever get an actual new Dead Space. We might just get three remakes. <clears throat> Unless they explain it away, like uh, the moons weren't really there. They were still just fucking with Isaac and them. Carver and Isaac are still alive, and now they have to stop the moons because they know they're coming. They have like three days or some shit. I don't know. But this just turned into Majora's Mask. Yes. <laughs> Running around like. Where's my tingle bottle? Yeah. I don't know, but that was the Dead Space DLC, guys. Thanks for coming and hanging out with us. It was a little disappointing. If you want coffee, check out Coffee Brand Coffee or uh, W Energy Drinks. Is links in the description below. But uh, we'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Peace.